Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Linda from Nevada. Another cooking segment. I'm sorry if my camera is not doing well here. Um, what I'm making now tonight is some um, hamburgers. Excuse me while I'm out of the picture. Um, if you saw my meatloaf video, it's pretty much the same thing. Um, except I'm making hamburgers out of this. So I'm chopping up a little bit of onion, and I'm going to put that to my hamburger, which is uh, meat that I, des I got from the store, Albertsons. And you know how prices are. So, usually I'm mixing in, they're very hard. So usually, now I'm not I'm mixing in, sorry about usually, I'm mixing in the um, onion. I'm going to add part of my, my movement here, it'll be easier to hold it. And tonight I'm making mm -hmm. half and half. So I have made the meat and one half of this. That's going to be for the meatloaf, that half I just showed you. I put the other half in a bowl. I'm going to sprinkle some good parsley flakes with the meat mixture. Plus, guys, garlic powder. I'm just going to stick that in there, a little bit of it. And if you like uh, salt and pepper to taste, that's fine. For me, I got high blood pressure, so I can't use that much. Any much salt, so I'm just using what we have for the garlic powder here. So I'm making that, and I'm making them into patties now. So it's only a little bit of uh, onion here, not much, because you really want to get that patty going. So I'm going to do that first. I should have one bird coming here, right? So let me um, get that. Because I got to use it for my uh, meatloaf anyway. Just a tiny bit. And We'll just uh, throw the patties back in. <laughs> yeah, I know. How crazy am I? Mix that in really well. A little bit of crunch. And then make the meatloaf. Excuse me, one minute. There was nobody. <laughs> one of those uh, scam callers. This is for tonight, the hamburgers. My husband's going to grill them when he comes home from work. And after we go to Taekwondo tonight, if you saw my other video with me in Taekwondo, I got my daughter going there too. She's a red belt and I'm a per, um, orange belt right now. Yes, I did take the test and got my orange belt. So I'm making them into patties. Now, I think four patties are enough because we only have one hot hamburger each. I'm getting my egg now for the rest of the meatloaf. And we're going to freeze the meatloaf egg. 
get that in there. Put this in there. All right. Now, I made one meat egg in there. One egg. Mix that up. A little bit of breadcrumb. Put that in there. Finish off the half of this garlic, um, onion. Get all that in there. And I'll put it in a plastic bag and put it in the freezer. They make the mold. Put it in the freezer bag. A little bit more garlic. Oh, this is going to be a small meatloaf. <laughs> and a little bit more breadcrumb because it's still wet. Okay. Tell me if you in the comments if you like meatloaf or the um, hamburgers and how you make them. I'm gonna try. I want to try new all new ways here. Try to get rid of the good onion. A lot of there's a lot of onion in here because my husband. When we went shopping yesterday, I said, let's get the the, rig, the hamburgers that are done. He said no. He wanted to have the, he bought the meat. And it's a small piece of meat too, let me tell you. So, I hope this works. I'll kill him. <laughs> so I made the meatloaf. Up the bag. This is what it comes in. How I did it. Well, the onion, garlic powder, breadcrumb, and uh, egg. Mixture, put it in the freezer, and we're done for tonight. This is Linda from Nevada. Um, comment, share, like the video. Uh, please, like I asked you if anybody watches my videos, please comment in the section on how I can make my videos better. I'd like to hear from you. Bye for now.